Hello you lovely people, welcome back to my channel for VR guys, yeah, a VR to the fantastic Yorkshireman 66 mark. I haven't done one of these for a long time guys, but the question that was originally set to him, I'm not too sure who started it off, I do believe it was Hillboy, but Mark answered it and he's now put it out to other youtubers guys he didn't name me but i thought i'd jump on anyway guys and answer the question too but the question is what is youtube to you now to me guys i've told this story before the reasons why i set my channel up i mean my channel's been going um for a very long time guys but originally it was a day out video you know videos going up like uh, family days out and things i still do a bit of that but that channel's long gone. This channel I've been doing just short of five years. Um, and I set it up, guys, because people around me were getting bloody bored of me talking about bloody video games all the time. You know, you'd see my missus and the kids and family members, their eyes glazing over. And I thought, you know what? Oh, there's got to be, you know, like-minded people out there, hasn't it? And I'd been watching other youtubers you know gaming channels guys like some of the american ones like metal jesus john hancock radical reggie and what have you i'd been watching them for a long time and i also watched a lot of the english ones like slopes game room or the fantastic the fantastic slopes game room guys and steve benway oh so many guys and you know what i thought to myself one day you know i could do that and when I first started, guys, it was there, those videos, they're still up there. You can go and watch them in my library. They were very rough around the edges. At first, I didn't even show my face, guys. I was too shy to do that. They were all kind of done at my uh, <laughs> at my kitchen table. And, uh, yeah, you can hear my monotone voice talking like a robot. Uh, but things have gone a long way since then. But that is why I set it up. So, the reasons why i have a youtube guys quite frankly it was to find like-minded people and little did i know that i was going to find some of the best friends you could ever ever ask for guys i have got some fantastic friends out there guys there's too many to mention you know who you are guys you know who you are and uh I, you know i've just made some fantastic relationships with other people guys friendships that are probably going to be there for life um so that was a massive added bonus. I never expected that in a million years. And yes, you do have the negative side of YouTube. I have literally been bullied, guys. 51-year-old man's been bullied. Although at 51, it takes a lot to get a, you know, a bully to really get to me. It takes a freaking lot, guys. I do get upset and I do get a bit down. But, you know, it's part and parcel of putting yourself out there. Uh, another reason why I do my channel is because um you know i want to show you my hobby guys i want to show you my hobby that has been a hobby oh for so long guys i mean i'm surrounded by this stuff i want to show other people um what you can do within the hobby of video game collecting uh so yeah absolutely fantastic for that as well guys to showcase some very rare systems sometimes you know they're not necessarily worth a packet but some of them are very rare because you just don't find them. Doesn't mean they're worth a fortune. Um, there's a lot of stuff in my collection that other people don't even know exist, guys. Uh, you know, things like the Gizmondo, the uh, the TigerGame.com, the Supervision and things like that, guys. And 3 do even, you know, uh, Atari Jaguar. There's a lot of systems there that other people don't necessarily know ever existed. And it's a shame. The Pocket Neo Geo springs to mind as well. Um, so yeah, it was a way of showcasing things like that. Because at the end of the day, my game room is a museum, guys. That's what it's like. Because half the time, I don't even use the original hardware because I'm too scared to. Which was why it was so fantastic when I won 
the uh, giveaway gaming granddad was doing and i won the retro on five because it saves me using the hardware sometimes you know brilliant brilliant so yeah that is another reason guys uh, another reason is it gives you something to strive for doesn't it um you know you want to make more content you're going to buy more purchases you're going to you know try and create some more videos it gets you thinking guys it gets you thinking it gets the old brain matter ticking over because you've always got to come up with new ideas so that's another reason guys you know especially during the uh, covid when i was off work for 16 weeks guys like like i keep saying guys i'm still not right uh, i still have to work minimal hours and what have you I, I i get so poorly still it's unbelievable i've got all sorts of other issues going on now as well it got me through all that guys it got me through those 16 weeks um i was knocking out like three videos a flipping day guys way too many really but it kept me busy that is why I did knock so many out because it was a fantastic way of uh, not getting bored basically of having something to turn to uh, which unfortunately a hell of a lot of people didn't do that they were going stir crazy um, over their bloody Covid lockdown and what have you um, so yeah that is another reason guys so there you have it they are my reasons for having a YouTube channel I hope you uh, yeah you can see why uh, you can understand and uh, you know maybe understand a little bit more than you did in the past guys of why i have a youtube channel and why i uh, you know i'm striving to uh, in the end i'll be quite honest with you guys i would like to make a little bit out of it because you know especially when you are on basic hours guys it would help you know that's why i have a patreon that is all to feed the game room guys because you're not earning as much to spend on it you know i'm earning enough to live um so yeah through patreon and if then, you know, because there's adverts attached to my videos all over, left, right and centre, guys. So once I reach that magic thousand, guys, I'll be able to uh, put some money, you know, as little as it might be to begin with, guys, as little as it might be, put a little bit of money towards this game room. Um, because I'm not sure if I'm ever going to be back to full health, guys. I'm going to do what I can, um, you know, and get by. Uh, and that's all you can do, isn't it, really, in life um, when you've been knocked so badly health wise uh you know i do still go to work obviously like i say minimal hours but um yeah minimum hours get it right oh but yeah there we go guys that is my response to yorkshireman 66 so yeah i'm not hiding behind it guys yes i would like to make a bit of money out of it it's not a bloody great tragedy if i don't um because I, it's not going to stop me that's for sure because it's my hobby you know first and foremost it's my hobby but I will be honest, it would be nice if I could make a bit of money out of it and uh, keep this going, guys. You know, oh, it would be fantastic. So there you go. Right with that, guys, I'm going to move over to my giveaway. I keep pumping it, guys. Keep pumping it. Yeah, it's my uh, thousand sub giveaway, guys. I am nearly there. Nearly flipping there, guys. I can't believe it. Uh, nearly there. So what can you win if you enter my giveaway? Well, you can win a North American Evercade. Brand new, sealed. There we are. Now, I call it my 1,000 sub giveaway because I haven't quite reached it yet, have I? Started it a while ago, guys, so that everybody had a chance to enter. Uh, so, yeah, once I reach a 1,000 subs, guys, me and Josh are going to pull the winner with a random comment generator. And then you can win this North American brand new sealed Evercade portable doesn't matter it's not region locked guys you can play the cartridges from wherever you get them uh the only difference is it only has one cartridge in it unlike the uh like the uk edition of this uh which has two cartridges they couldn't get the licensing right on the second cartridge so it had to be taken out but yet yeah, you get the one cartridge in there and to make up for that guys you're also going to get a sealed interplay collection one as well so yet yeah, you're still going to get your two cartridges guys i have made sure of that for you so yeah, fantastic prize, guys, for somebody. And as I say, even if you not, you know, if you've got one, guys, yeah, make a fantastic present. Christmas is coming. Make a brilliant present for maybe one of your kids, somebody in your family, or just in your friend circle, guys. Make a brilliant, brilliant present. So what you got to do to win it, guys? Well, down below, linked is the uh, giveaway video, the original giveaway video for this. Um. Head over there, guys, because that's the video I need you to comment on. Because once you've commented, 
you're entered into the giveaway. At the moment, I think there's about 85 people entered, so the odds are bloody good, guys. The odds are good that you could win. Uh, one comment per person, guys, is one of the rules. One comment per person. doesn't matter if there's six people in your house and they've all got a separate YouTube account, then they can all enter, can't they? You must be subscribed to my channel. We will check all this, guys. We will check it. Me and Josh will check it all. So, yeah, that, that is the only other rule, guys, that you must be subscribed. You can be anywhere in the world. This is open to everybody. We will get the prize to you if you win it, even if you live in Outer Mongolia. I will make sure that you get the prize. So, yeah, it's as simple as that, guys. And then, like I said, once I reach 1,000 subs, we'll pull the winner with a random comment generator. So, yeah. Head below, guys. Go and comment away. And, uh, yeah, what a fantastic giveaway, guys. Oh, and it's just a big thank you to you all for being so wonderful. It really, really is. Right, and now, guys, I want to do my usuals. If you're not subbed already, please drop me a sub. Give me a bummy thumbs up if you feel that way inclined. And, of course, tap the bell icon and the all icon to get any future notifications. And, again, guys, if you like the classics, the retro classics, emulation could be a good way forward for you if it's a handheld or plug in a system into the tv i've got a fantastic group for you on facebook it is the retro emulation fan group that me and my best friend nate set up some time ago we have an ever growing member base guys i do believe we're on 440 members as we speak wow that is fantastic tons of videos for you to watch guys tons and tons from system reviews simulation performance oh there's a ton there guys tons of things tech help videos wow tons for you to watch so yeah if you just love emulation guys or just want to come and have a banter with like-minded emulation enthusiasts link below head over and come and join the fun then guys i also have my uk crap gaming facebook group as well where we cover everything from retro to modern gaming guys so everything from pong machines to ps5s and everything in between again a ton of videos there guys because other youtubers are putting their videos up all the time there's a ton of videos for you to sink teeth into. Brilliant. And again, guys, ever growing member base. Brilliant to come over and just have a banter with them and the fantastic admin team. So again, link below, guys. Head over, ask to join, and I will accept you in no time. And then finally, guys, I have a Patreon. As I was saying earlier, there's a video there as well, guys, and it's linked below. If you want to go over to my Patreon. Give it a watch, guys. It explains why I decided to set it up. Although I've just explained it to you. Um, yeah, give it a watch and then see if you want to join me on my Patreon journey. And with that, guys, I'm going to love you and leave you and say I'll be the same. Tschüss and goodbye. And I'll see you in the next one, guys. Bye-bye.